Hello, everybody, and welcome into the show. I'm your host, Maya Powell, and you are watching a live stream show from Social Grace Co. Um, we are going to be doing a live makeover in today's show using Vintage by Jessica Liebeskind Cosmetics. So if after the past year, you've been feeling like you want to refresh your look and get some new fresh products, these are the makeup essentials that you are going to go gaga over. Easy to use beautiful color payoff and more importantly timeless I think so I'm really excited to do this makeover live with you again I'm Maya Powell your host for the evening and I'm be joined by Jessica Liebeskind herself in just a little bit again this is a social grace co live stream so if you've never heard of us I want to welcome you in social grace co is a really new and exciting way for you to shop from uh, for products from home with experts from all over the US bringing us one of a kind products luxury products at insanely good prices and this show is no different there's some crazy good deals coming up tonight you can check this out at socialgraceco.com and i want to tell you how to shop before i introduce our very special guest so if you are watching the show from the social grace co website already you're at the right place you're going to be shopping for everything that you see in this show and so much more again already at the right place but if you are shopping from facebook from social media you can shop for all the products that you're going to see in this show by just going to the link in the description of this post. It's going to take you right over to everything that we're going to be using tonight. So really, really easy to shop with us this evening. I'd love to connect with you. So if you have any questions whatsoever for me or our special guest, Jessica, who is truly a makeup guru, she's a genius. You're definitely going to want to drop those questions in the comment section for Jessica, and we'll get to you throughout the show. I'd also love to know where you're shopping from. So I'm actually here in Vermont. It is finally sunny. Yes, I'm super excited about that. We're getting 80 degree days finally up here in the Northeast. So it's really nice. So let me know where you're at. Maybe let me know what the weather's like. I'd love to hear from you. So without further ado, let's get this face all glammed up, right? I'm, I'm looking okay, but I could look a lot better with some vintage cosmetics. So let me welcome in Jessica. Jessica Liebeskind, she has one of the most fascinating stories I've ever heard. She's an incredible boss babe who I truly admire, featured in Elle, Oprah, and so much more. Jessica, welcome in. How are you, girlfriend? I'm doing great, and I am so happy it's sunny here in Denver, Colorado as well. Yay. We had a park day with the kids. Very good. So nice. It was really great. It's beautiful. Glad to hear that we're both getting some much needed vitamin D. Um, but we'll also be getting some good blush. If we're not getting that natural vitamin D, right, we're going to get some good blush coming up in a little bit. I would love for you to share just a quick little highlight reel of your story because when you shared with me how you got into this industry, it just blew my mind. It is the stuff of lifetime movies. <laughs> oh my gosh, you are the sweetest. Well, I have had a passion for beauty for over for a lifetime, really, but a career for over 25 years. I started with every girl's fantasy of creating a collection of cosmetics that was stowed on, in camp trunks under my bed in my sorority house back at Syracuse University. I then parlayed that uh, section of my uh, life into a really cool career in Manhattan. I worked for some of the biggest beauty brands uh, in the world, Bobbi Brown, Estee Lauder, creating their color cosmetics. I then started working as a celebrity makeup artist, having done shows like Gucci, Jill Sander, Catherine Malandrino, Diane von Furstenberg, and many, many more. And the most rewarding thing, beyond just making magnificent makeup and painting the faces of some of the most beautiful women women in the world is meeting women just like yourself who who turn to me as your best girlfriend as your own personal makeup artist and I can share with you my philosophy on beauty which is to look like yourself use makeup as a tool to enhance not disguise bring out your best features and feel confident and beautiful with who you are the products that I have created are done to do exactly that make you feel like yourself and look like yourself but better because let's face it when we look at ourselves, we sometimes see what's wrong. When 
Everyone else looks at us. They're admiring our beautiful eyes, our magnificent smile, our gorgeous skin. So play up what you've got. And that's why I'm here to help you do exactly that. I love that, Jessica. Thank you so, so much. And you're right. It's all about just enhancing that natural beauty that's already there. And that's what I love about your cosmetics so much because they give you, again, that gorgeous color payoff, super, super easy to use, but you're still going to look like yourself, just kind of amplified. So, you know, I think for me, at least like over the past year, I haven't been wearing as much makeup. So I'm ready to get back into it because I'm realizing, oh my gosh, it makes me feel so much more confident. And speaking of which, blush is really where it's at when it comes to bringing life back into the complexion, making our cheekbones pop and really just making our skin look incredible. So the first product that we're going to talk about today and the first product I'm going to demo is the Pink Blossom Blush Brighten and Glow Set. So this is going to come with your set of blushes. Jessica is going to fill us in on why we're getting two because there's a pretty cool reason behind that. We're also getting the rose gold highlighter. Is that correct, Jessica? We're going to get the um, crystal pink highlighter. Crystal pink. Yeah. Excuse me. Thank you, girl. I get my highlighters mixed up sometimes. So here is the crystal pink highlighter that you're going to be getting. You're also going to get a bonus of a lip gloss and a lip crayon. Here is your lip gloss color. It's the pink sequin gloss. We're going to be showing that off in just a little bit. You're also going to be getting my go-to lip pencil for free, both the lip gloss and the pencil in the set. This is the perfect nude shade. You can wear it under any of your glasses. You can wear it alone and that's coming for free with the set. So that's pretty amazing. The set is the highlighter again and that blusher set, $48, normally 98. Okay, so I need you to break it down. What is the deal with having two different blushes? Tell me all about it. First of all, pink is it. Pink is really for everybody and every woman needs two shades of blush. You need a soft, neutral color, that's your blossom, and a brighter tone, that's your poppy, to give it lift and pop. Because I look at the cheeks as what brings the whole face together. It's what mm -hmm. drives it home. It is the accessory, the best accessory, the belt, the bag, the shoes of your face. So it connects the eyes with the lips. By taking a powder blush brush, and tap okay. it right into that neutral shade. You are going to- The lighter first? The lighter first. That is okay. your everyday blush. And my secret tip. Oh no, I think we lost you for a second. So I know this secret tip oh, really yeah. well because- and Oh, there we go. We got you back. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. So I'm gonna repeat what I said in case you didn't hear me live, live TV. Um, you're gonna apply blush like an oversized check mark going down and back. Because when you smile, that's really that? how it looks. Totally. That's right. Makes the cheekbone pop instantly. Instantly. I love that. Not only does it make it pop, but it's connected. It just bridges your whole face. It's where you flush naturally. It's the, where you place it, where you would exercise, you know, where you get flushy after you exercise. That's a great, great tip. The next thing you do after you apply that neutral blush is you take that okay. beautiful pop color, that's the pop, okay. and lay it right on top of those, right on those apples. The result is refreshing. It's pretty. It's feminine. It's just so beautiful. I mean, pink really is the prettiest color. And what I love most about it is that pink is in every woman's skin tone. So it works well on everyone, whether you're an alabaster beauty, whether you have medium toned skin, whether you have really rich, sexy cocoa skin, we have created shades that are going to work perfectly on you. Between the neutral and that pop color, they are both going to work perfectly year mm -hmm. round on all skin tones and all skin types. It's so right. true. And you and I have totally different skin tones. You know, I'm pale as a piece of paper. You have that beautiful olive tone skin. And I love that we're both getting really that perfect shade that almost looks custom to our skin. And what you noticed as I was putting this on, right, I just had some tinted moisturizer on before. My cheeks look rosier. 
I look more awake. I look more alive to Jessica's point. My lips are kind of connecting and jiving with what's going on on my cheeks. So I look a little bit more cohesive and awake already. And what I love so much about that pop shade, so that's our darker shade right here, mm -hmm. is that it really does, again, it emphasizes that cheekbone. And then you have that brighter shade, that brightener, right? That's really just giving you that full flushed moment that makes you look healthy and more youthful. And they just work so well together. Jessica, I use this almost every single day. Right. It's great for a no makeup makeup look, but even when I'm on air for you know 10 plus hours in one day sometimes, I love that this looks as glam as I need it to look on those full face, full face, excuse me, days, but it looks as, you know, kind of chillaxed and casual as I want it to when I'm just kind of running around. Absolutely. And a great tip for our mature beauties out there. As we age, we lose color in our skin and this restores that color. It gives you back that youthful quality that sometimes we feel is missing as we mm -hmm. get older. It just picks you right up. It is. It's like a pick me up. That's the perfect way to say it. And speaking of which, I have never done this before meeting you. And now I'm obsessed with this pick me up. Layering the highlighter in crystal pink over the top of the blush is something that I learned from you in one of our last shows. And what I love so much about this highlighter is, of course, you can use it as a highlighter. It gives you that beautiful pearlized finish that is just divine. It feels almost weightless when you're wearing it, by the way. But when you layer this on over the top of the blush, it really gives you an airbrushed look. So if you struggle with getting that perfect blended look, or you're somebody that has fine lines or wrinkles or enlarged pores, I have big pores. I don't know what's going on with that. I've been trying for years to make them smaller, but one thing that does make them look smaller is adding this highlighter over the top of the blush. And that's what you recommend, right? Just kind of doing a little layering. Absolutely. This really delivers the pearl radiance that every woman mm. is looking for. It's that perfect candle lit, lit one within look. It is luminous. It gives that perfect glow to the skin. It looks like you've had that perfect facial. You know how someone mm -hmm. has that facial? It does. Chloe everywhere and you're like, I don't want to wash my face. <laughs> it looks so good. Right? Totally. It does. It's radiant. Like you said, but it's not. So one thing I love about this is it's radiant, but it's not like wet looking. So no. sometimes a highlighter, you put it on and you're like, oh, I look kind of oily or like I've spritzed my face with water. That's not the case with this one. Again, it's just that radiant feel, that radiant look that does make you look more youthful and that does make your skin look flawless. It's like it's been airbrushed on. One thing I really like to do, Jessica, is I just put a little bit on oh my, my cupid bow. How chic is that? Look at how beautiful. It makes your lips look bigger, doesn't I it? I haven't even done that. That's, that's a little look. That's a beautiful tip. You need to do that. Oh my gosh, that's my favorite thing to do. So you can also put it in just the inner corners of your eyes. So if you wake up and you're like, oh my gosh, I look so tired. What's going on with me today? Put a little bit on the centers of your lid and in the waterline. And it just, don't I look more awake? Boop. Hello. <laughs> But yeah, it's very all you need to do. Understated way. You know, and that's what I love yeah. about this makeup. All of the makeup that we have created is designed to enhance your best features and designed mm -hmm. to make you look like yourself, but better. Where look at how look at my look how gorgeous. You've popped your lips, you your eyes are standing out. Like you just look so incredibly beautiful. And if you're someone Thank that you. Um, you know, just a little bit of something by layering it gently just over that pop of pretty blush. That's it. That's all you need. That's all you need. That's all we've done. And, you know, isn't that gorgeous. crazy? Yeah. It's the fact that all I have on right now, you guys, tinted moisturizer. I did fill in my eyebrows. Now I've just done the Blossom and Poppy, right? Just Blossom and Poppy highlighter. I use, by the way, a brush that's available online, a Vintage Cosmetics blush brush. I just have highlighter and blush on right now. Again, coming with that double bonus. So a mini size of this pink sequin gloss and the lip liner. Okay, so you've seen how much of an impact that can make, just two simple steps. 
towards a more glowy, youthful complexion. Now we're going to move on to the eyes, right? Because it's the window to the soul. It's what we all see with our masks on. Hopefully we'll get to take those off pretty soon. But right now it's all about the eyes. This is the Brighten and Define kit. It comes in two different shades, one for an extra light skin tone and one for a medium to tan skin tone. It's an $82 value. I told you the deals were going to be amazing and they are. It's only $38 right now. We do have brushes that I'm going to be using that you can find online. So if you're wondering how I'm applying this, that is how. This does come with, again, that same uh, or a similar bonus. So you are getting a mini size pink sequin gloss that I demoed on my hand a little bit earlier, that one right there. And you will also get the jet black eye pencil. And we're gonna talk about that in just a moment. This is one of the most creamy eyeliners I've ever used. It's so, so good whether you're doing a tight line or a smudged, really sexy, smoky eye. So Jessica, since we have two colors, I want a little bit of help here understanding what we or sorry I'm it's a little bright here so you can't see the difference as well on my screen but I have vanilla espresso which is a little bit darker in terms of that base shade and then I also have the lace caviar and this lace caviar is for someone like me right really pale absolutely or so, fair is maybe a better way to say it right beautiful and fair and so lace caviar <laughs> is like a white sort of like a white um, powder and the right. um, and with a caviar liner, which is super super dark, and that is wonderful for women with extra light to light skin. And you apply it with the brightening eyeshadow brush, and I should from lash line to brow. And so while you're doing that, I'm just going to talk about the vanilla espresso option, which is a little right. bit more vanilla in color. And what I love, even with these crazy lights that I have here in, in my home, is that the um, colors are really, the names of the shade really, uh, in, um, the names of the shades mimic what the shade looks like. So if you're confused, it does. that's a great way to know which one is gonna be best for you. And what I love, mm -hmm palette is that it is your everything palette. I call it the bra and underwear of your beauty routine. You literally <laughs> I love that. the light shade and apply from lash line to brow. This is your all over eye brightener. This is your shadow base. This is um, what's going up. You can use to pop under the brow just to give yourself that lift that I always love talking about. It really is designed to work with any of the eyeshadows you have at home, or if you're a makeup minimalist like myself, so for as much as I love beauty, I really try and keep my routine simple. This is my everyday go-to. It comes with a really fabulous defining eyeliner, which you can use wet or dry, and it you can find the defining liner brush online as well. And what I love, these natural hair brushes are really designed to accommodate the line of the eye. So the brightening eyeshadow brush goes with your brightening shadow shade, the defining liner brush, which I'm holding, goes with the defining color in that palette. And you can use this to create a nice tight line damp. You can use it to smoke yep. out your eyeliner. You can make it nice and smudgy underneath to give yourself those sexy, gorgeous eyes so that when you are wearing your mask, those eyes pop. Or they uh, do. when you're in the privacy of your home or backyard and you're showing off your face, those eyes are dazzling. So dazzling. And so before I finish my other eye, I just wanted to show the difference, right? Because I think it's pretty impactful. I also want to fix this hair that is just like really annoying me. Okay. This is live. So I just figured I'd let you know what I'm doing. I just, you know, when you have that hair that's in your way. Anyways. Okay. So I have only done my right eye. Look at how much bigger it looks than the left eye. Number one. Number two, the whites of my eyes look brighter. So that's that brightening effect, right? It looks more defined. So my lashes look bigger. By the way, I am wearing Vintage by Jessica Leave Skin Mascara already, which is my go-to. Absolutely love that. It is online. If you want to check it out, socialgraceco.com. You can also click the link that is in this post description. If you are shopping from social media, you'll be able to find that mascara. But anyways, when you, and there it is right there, $18. It is like, I would pay $70 for that mascara. It's so good. So that's what I have on. But 
I love the way that that defining shade, and by the way, I am wearing the lace and caviar, the defining shade makes your lashes really come to life. Again, it's all about that definition. Another thing that's really incredible about this, Jessica, and what I think it's so smart, the way that, or I think it's so smart the way you call this the bra and panties of your makeup routine, because whether you are doing a casual no makeup makeup look like I like to do day to day, or you're going full glam, this is the perfect base. When you're going full glam, it's always smart to start with that really light shade underneath because that way your colors pop. So think about that. If you love to do a bright eyeshadow or really any eyeshadow at all, this is what you want to be start starting with. It's almost like a primer I am going to do the other eye so that I look even, but I just wanted to call that out and just show the difference in real time because I do think it's really impactful and it does make you look more awake as well. So if you wake up in the morning and you're feeling a little bit kind of, you know, sleepy, you feel like your eyes look tired, this is the perfect set for you to grab. And it's a gr another great tip is that I love to use the defining liner with the remnants of my um, dark shade for lining and put it in the brow. It gives polish. Oh, let me do eyeliner. that. It gives definition to the brow. It really is your all-in-one compact because anyone mm -hmm. using eyeshadows, you're always using a light and a dark to brighten up or to define and you use whatever you like on your lid or in your crease. But like I said, I'm a minimalist and I like the essentials because it's what we use every single day. It keeps our right. beauty simplified. And us looking it does. Gorgeous, for that matter. Yeah. And I think when they're like anything in your life, right? When there is very little resistance, you end up doing it more. So like for your makeup routine, when it's this easy, there's no resistance to doing your makeup in the morning. Cause you're like, Oh, it's just a couple of steps that I can easily do myself at home that are going to make a big impact and are going to make me feel incredible. I know when I look well rested, that's when I feel my most confident. And that's one of the things I absolutely love about both the blush and the brighten and define because they do give you that youthful look, that energetic look, that awake look that is frankly so important to have um, day to day. And it's just so easy. And there's great color payoff. I mean, this lasts all day. You don't need to use much. And it's everything from, you know, highlighting that brow bone to doing your eyebrows to doing eyeliner to just creating a nice primed base. Um, it's really the perfect set, in my opinion. So kudos to you, because I just, I went to LA recently and I only brought like five pieces of makeup and this came with me and I used it every single day. Oh, you're so sweet. One of the, one of my favorite stories before um, I, I launched the collection in a, in a big way, I was meeting some women in Scottsdale, Arizona, and we were having mm -hmm. a girls night and I was sh showing them everything and introducing them to everything. And the, I received a, 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 an email message from one of the ladies' husbands that says, you've got to be doing something right because my wife came home, she took out her trash can, threw out everything yeah. she had and just had these pieces and said, honey, this is all I need. And I started I laughing. I love that. It was great. I mean, that is like the best feeling when you just find something that's so good that you're like, you know what? I don't even need all of this other stuff. It's just taking up space. It's not something I want to use every day. Before we move on to our next product, I just want to show you really quick because this is the best jet black eyeliner and this is coming in the set. So you've seen I create that nice, deep, defined line. Super easy to do with this. There is no tugging. It's ultra creamy. Now, before this sets, I want to show you, you can smudge it super, super easy. So if you're like a one and done gal and you just want to do like mascara and one thing, you can just use this eye pencil to create a smoky eye, or you can do a nice tight line. You can line your rim. It's so, so easy. Why is this so creamy? Why is this so good? This is like the creamiest, smudgiest, most sultry eyeliner that you will ever ever wear. It is the blackest black. It makes the eyes pop. And I love just a super smoky eye. That is just mine. Mm -hmm. And this is exactly, does exactly that. You can lay it down on your line and then you can take um, your defining liner brush if you want 
and smudge that out if you or you can use your fingertip and pat it and make look how amazing you look and you can see it's so sexy and it's so easy so <laughs> sexy and easy you, you can see i wear mine like thick and tight and my you wear yours like in this sexy smoldering way and it is just got edge and it's cool and it's beautiful and i love it and it's gonna look amazing on you black black liner looks amazing on every woman it really does and you know I'm like a messy makeup person. Like I just like anything where I can go like this. So I love the fact <laughs> that, and I'm not a professional. That's why I call myself a messy makeup person. Oh, but cool. I love the fact that you can smudge it and then it stays all day. And if you do that tight line, so I just want to show you this. I'm going to finish that tight line just on my hand. I'm going to let this set for just a second. When you do let that tight line set, it's not going to smudge. So it's really cool because you do get that smoky eye effect when you want it. But then when you do just want that tight line, it's not going to smudge. See that? Pretty, pretty cool. So I love the duality of that product. It's amazing. Just really quick, just want to recap the fact that you're also getting this pink sequin gloss. This is one of the most universally flattering shades of just really light crystal pink. Sorry, I have too many things on my hand now. I'll go like this. <laughs> it's a beautiful, glistening, non-sticky formula. That's the pink sequin that's coming in this. You're also getting, of course, the Brighten and Define set in either your choice of the vanilla espresso or the lace caviar, along with that Jet Black Smoky Eye Pencil, which is the most creamy formula I've ever used. Even if you're not good at doing eyeliner, like I wouldn't consider myself necessarily good at doing eyeliner. It makes it easy because it's not tugging, it's not pulling. And when, let's face it, you're using an eyeliner that's tugging and pulling, that's when you kind of mess up the tight line. So try this out if you have struggled with that in the past, if you wanna look more awake, if you wanna define and brighten your eyes, that's the name of the game with this kit. Such an incredible set and only $38. All right, we're moving on to our final product. This is another product that I'm absolutely obsessed with. I love like that sexy glam of a good lip gloss. This lip gloss makes your lips look Hollywood chic in one fell swoop. We have, as you can see, a variety of colors. So up on your screen right now, you see all those different colors. There are four different color selections for you to choose from and you will get one gloss for $18. It's an incredible value. It's a really large gloss in some of the most beautiful packaging. All of Jessica's packaging is so, so incredibly glam and luxe with the gold. I mean, I just love it. So the color options that we have for you today, papaya. This one I think of as like that perfect Miami beach coral shade. So, so pretty. We also have the rosebud so this is that timeless i think of like old hollywood starlet pink so pretty a little bit mauvey then we also have the snowflake i jessica i love using the snowflake over your lip liner i think that looks really really pretty and then we also have the pink sequin so the pink sequin is the mini gloss that's coming in the kits that we just showed you this is a little bit more of that almost like lilac icy pink and I love that you swatched these. I'm so sorry, I have too much stuff on my hand. I need to take it off. But um, okay, this lip gloss, incredible over a lip liner. So I'm gonna show that. And if you could tell us a little bit about this formula, who this is for, how we use it, I would love that. Absolutely. Well, this is jewelry for your lips. This is truly the most beautiful, romantic, sparkling gloss you have ever tried it is smooth to the touch it comes with a beautiful professional size brush and it layers magnificently over any lipstick any lip crayon partners with a with that beautiful mocha pencil that you see here um either filled in after gloss has been applied or um as Maya is doing it, she applies that lip pencil and then layers that gloss right into the mouth. I'm gonna go through the colors with you again. Um, they are swatched on my hand. The first is papaya. It is that beautiful Miami Beach coral. If you have fair skin, if you have red hair, if you are a strawberry blonde, this is your mm -hmm. perfect coral. But more than that, for someone like myself, I actually made this selfishly because I am a pink person. 
I made this papaya shade with a little bit of pink to make it universally wearable so that every woman, no matter what your skin tone, no matter what your hair color, whether you're silver, fox, whether you're a strawberry blonde or whether you're brunette like myself, it's going to be perfect. The next shade is Rosebud. And Rosebud is like the most beautiful blooming flower in your garden. It is for girls that love pink. It's for women that like a little bit more color on the mouth, don't like something so muted, but need something that's going to give you that boost and that lift to help you feel a little bit more awake. Um, it is a magnificent, magnificent rose. Third, we have that beautiful, beautiful um, pink sequin, which is right here. This is the one that we are going to be giving away with those kits. So you've got one for your purse, and now you have one to keep um, in your beauty arsenal at home. It is an icy lilac -y pink. It's mauve. Mm -hmm. It's sexy. It pairs well with a smoky eye beautifully. It's also for girls that like a no makeup makeup and just want something soft to wear on the lips. Mm -hmm. And lastly, we have that gorgeous snowflake. That's what you see. I love that. Um, and this was made and the name Snowflake because when I started my beauty brand, uh, my first brand, I should say, out of my sorority house back in Syracuse University where it snowed probably 363 days out of the year. Um, no, it's super snowy, super cold. So I wanted that beautiful snowflake shade. It's pale, it's modern, and it has some beautiful iridescence to it. So it's a perfect okay. lip gloss, or if you want to wear something other than chapstick, it is an elegant. Oh, of yeah, that's a good idea. I love it. And I love the mocha lip pencil. So if any of you picked up on the sets that we were showing, the mocha lip pencil actually comes with those sets. So that's what I wore. It's that darker shade that you see on my hand right here. It's one of the most creamy, decadent, luxe formulas. It's my personal favorite lip liner because I have chronically trapped lips. I don't know what's up with that, but I just do. And so oftentimes I'll find that a liner just highlights that dryness, whereas this liner masks and camouflages the dryness, doesn't highlight any like lip flakies at all and I can either overline my lips or just kind of do one line and kind of contain my lip gloss or my lipstick in that way so it's really versatile it looks good on everybody just wanted to share with you that that's what I'm layering with so I have the pink sequin or excuse me the snowflake over the top and one of the things I love about this snowflake Jessica and really with all your glosses is the fact that you get that really glossy look that makes your pout look perfectly plump and youthful, but it's not sticky no. and it's not like the juvenile glitter. It's just that glisten. Yes, this is not your daughter's lip gloss. This is a mm -mm. sophisticated, elegant, beautiful gloss that really has the right level of color payoff. Uh, I don't mean to sound so technical on you, but color payoff. <laughs> what how much color is actually being released on the mouth so how much color is showing so it has just the right amount to not look overdone and yet mm -hmm. not too little you know some glosses you're like this is such a beautiful color and you go to put it on you're like where is it and you just keep piling it on where well, is it? yeah well, this is yeah. really professionally done it's crafted mm -hmm. with an artistic eye a by myself who is not only a makeup artist but a product formulator I've created the color cosmetics for some of the world's most celebrated beauty brands around the world. And I've taken all of that knowledge and all of that information and perfectly packaged it into a gorgeous, intimate cosmetics collection that you can enjoy, that's easy to use, where every shade is so easy to choose or hard if you just want them all. But it's, I've made it really simple for you. <laughs> Look, you're like your best self. It really is. And, you know, I think it's one of those things where you just pick up on a few different colors and you play around, mix and match, even mix a few together it can look really, really pretty. Actually, I'm going to do that. Um, I'm going to put a little rosebud over the top and just have some fun. But lip gloss is one of those easy, you know, beauty essentials that when you just put it on, it brings your face to life. It's kind of like wearing a good blush, right? It brings everything together. It makes your lips look more luscious and hydrated. And if you've been struggling to find a lip gloss that is not sticky while still giving you that really wet glam look, 
this is the lip gloss you grab and at only $18, it's really an incredible value. I mean, I've paid Jessica, some of those brands that you've worked for developing color cosmetics with, you know, I've paid $40 for a lip gloss that was Absolutely. almost imperceptible on my lips. Absolutely. I've paid $40 for a lip gloss that I'm just like Tacky. feeling really sticky. So I, I love the fact that we're getting an ultra premium gloss that's normally $35 for 18. And not only that, coming in that beautiful box. Thank you so much for showing that. So your, your cosmetics come in the most beautiful packaging. That thank you. And you you mentioned how beautiful it was when you were talking about the gloss, but this is actually our highlighter packaging. I wanted to create something giftable. I wanted something that you could covet, something you didn't want to throw away that just made you feel beautiful and special. So with that really affordable price tag, especially on those lip glosses, buy one oh for goodness. yourself, gift one for your girlfriends, for your aunties, for your best friends, someone who's just like so excited to smile again, who can really like show yes. how, how great life is right now that we are at a time where we can get back outside and it is something yeah. to think about so this beautiful products are really designed to help make you feel beautiful in every way and it's totally curated too that's another thing i love about this whole entire collection from the gloss to the blush to the eyes everything works so well together so it kind of takes the guesswork out of things you know a lot of us are so excited to get back out there to your point jessica i myself am excited to just go travel and see friends i haven't seen in year a year a year plus sometimes yes. i just saw yes. all my girlfriends out in la and i hadn't seen them in like a year and a half so i want to put my best face forward but you know for those of us who are like you know We've been home, we're not sure, you know, how we want to do our makeup or if we even like the stuff we have anymore, or what, we're just feeling a little lost when it comes to our beauty routine. I love that you make it so easy for us to get perfectly coordinated look with timeless makeup essentials that look good, whether you're 16 or you're 60 plus. I mean, mm -hmm. it's, it's truly magic. It's hard to find color cosmetics that work for every single generation, every single skin tone. So I just... I have to congratulate you. You've really, you've really done it perfectly here. Thank you so much. That's so kind of you. And I'm so excited to be here. Social Grace Co. is really a, a phenomenal, phenomenal partner with such a beautiful philosophy about giving back. And, and we're just so thrilled to be working with you. Really, we're really. Oh, thank you so much. And once again, everybody, if you are wanting to shop for anything you've seen in the show, please go ahead and check out socialgraceco.com. There is a link in the pro in the post description. So if you're watching this on social media, go to the post description, click the link. It's going to take you over to the Social Grace Co. website directly to the products that we've been talking about, as well as the brushes, the mascara, all of those cool add-ons that I love to use day-to-day -to, -day to just create flawless makeup looks from Jessica. Um, and if you are already watching from the Social Grace Co. website, you're in the right place. You can just easily mosey on over and check out all that we have to offer. So I'm really excited about this makeup look. I always learn a trick or two when I'm on camera with you. Thank you so much, Jessica, for helping me create a little glam this evening. I feel ready to go hang out with my in-laws now. I'm going to do the same. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much for having me. And thank you all for inviting me into your homes tonight. I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful evening. Well, thank you so much, Jess. So good to see you, girlfriend. Thank you so much, everybody. I hope you enjoyed watching the Social Grace Co. live stream. I hope you picked up on a few little glam tools to help you feel your very best for 2021. That's what it's all about. We're getting back out there. We're going to be beautiful. We're going to be effervescent. We're going to have fun. That's what it's all about. So thank you again so much for watching. Make sure to give us a follow at Social Grace Co. on Instagram. Follow us on Facebook for more incredible live streams. We're live streaming every single day. So tune in from everything from makeup to CBD to skincare to fashion and really so much more. We are your destination for products at a great price from vendors who give back. It's a really incredible way to shop. And I'm your host again, Maya Powell. Thank you so much for tuning in this evening. And I hope you have a beautiful night and I'll see you again soon. Mwah.